Hello everyone, today I'll be introducing you to Bright Crown's Black Fine Liner Pen Set. This is a really great set for ink work and it comes with 10 different pens and each pen has a different nib size. So um, the very first size and the smallest one is 0.2 millimeter thin nib. So each cap of these um, pens has a label showing you the size. So there's the thinnest size, it's really um, good for details and fine work. And then each pen following just goes up in um, small increments, so you can achieve a wide variety of line thicknesses. And the thickest um, straight nib is one millimeter size, and then it also comes with a brush tip which is very um, useful and versatile. And that brush tip is a 2.5 millimeter brush. So there are the tip sizes. And now I'm going to show you some artwork that I was able to create using this pen set. So I started off using the brush tip to create the bold outlines. Then I moved on to a medium sized tip, it was the size 5, to create some contours and um, create some shape to the mountain edges. And then using a more um, thin nib, it was size 2. I created some shading effects using um, lines to begin my cross hatching um, shadows. And then using the thinnest size I created some um, clusters of dots and specks just to add some texture and um, more um, definition to the mountains. And then I went over again creating some more shadows using the lines and some cross hatching. So now I'm just using the brush again to create a sort of forest line on the bottom of my mountain range. And I'm just creating some triangular shapes. It's very simple and very easy to do using the brush tip. And I have some in the foreground and I'm creating uh, many layers of them and having some in the mountains as well. And then using another um, different tip, a little bit smaller size, I can create some smaller trees in the background which just creates some perspective and a good sense of depth. Now I'm just going over and adding some shadow using my thinner tip and um, cleaning up any lines. Now using a smaller tip I can create some um, clouds in the background and then with the thinnest tip I'm able to create a nice sunshine effect by varying um, lengths of lines with um, longer and shorter lines alternating around a circle and then some birds in the background as well. And yeah, there you see, using just this one set, I was able to create a full um, drawing with depth and shadow. So this is definitely a very versatile and useful set for any type of artist, whether you're a beginner or more advanced. And with that, I'd like to conclude this video. I hope you enjoyed it and thank you for watching.